Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little video here talking about the LG G3 which has been offici made official today. Uh, it is LG's next flagship device with a 5.5 inch display, true HD IPS display, uh, LCD display in a quad HD resolution 26 times 1440 so 2k display uh, that we thought we would see on a lot of Galaxy devices but we didn't see that uh, 534 pixels per inch pretty insane uh, it only comes though with Snapdragon 801 I mean we've been hearing a Samsung and an impossible even HTC is gonna release devices next month in June uh, which is gonna feature possibly Snapdragon 805 uh, so 2.5GHz, Core 400, Adreno 330 GPU, 16GB of memory, I'm not super impressed, 2GB of RAM, 30 megapixel camera, I mean there's a lot of high-end devices now that comes with like 16 or 21 megapixels, 20 megapixel camera, so I'm definitely not impressed. Uh, it also it features a polycarbonate back which has like a metal finish, uh, it also is like scratch resistant. Uh, which which could be nice. I mean, it could definitely be nice to, to have that stuff inside. And uh, if we move on here, here you can see some uh, picture of the device. You will see that it will come in, in like a gold colored variant. And here you can also see like a, a white variant. Uh, 3000 milliamp battery. It's water, not waterproof or water resistant as the Sony Xperia Z2, uh, which is Sony flagship device for this year. Or uh, as the um, as the Samsung Galaxy S5. Uh, also, even though it, HSD hasn't said that the HSD One M8 is like water resistant, it seems to be able to handle wa water pretty well. Uh, from what we can see, of course, this phone comes uh, with an Android 4.2 KitKat with uh, LG's latest Optimus UI, uh, which uh, hopefully will be improved and not look as childish as uh, a lot of LG devices. I'm probably gonna pick up this device. Uh, I never pick up the LG G2 because earlier in the past I was so disappointed about LG's devices but it seems like possibly LG, LG can uh, come back a little bit perhaps hopefully because it's always nice with the competition uh, but this device is expected to be more uh, available in like Europe and other markets in um, in in June and it will be uh, launched here in South Korea very very soon uh, so um, that is definitely nice but I'm not really sure what I should say about this device it doesn't seem to have super impressive specs and uh, I really no idea if I'm gonna like it or not uh, but my Pinocchi is uh, at the ba back still and it uh, has um, still that little power button uh, uh, power lock button on, on the back as well. I don't like the gold color here. It doesn't look that very impressive uh, But yeah, I want to make a video about this. So um, yeah, I know